the obvious things to see are the big beautiful vistas and the and the perfect waves and all those things but there's always these little micro moments that like when you first wake up in the morning and you're having your coffee and you see a bug crawling across the sand and leaving a trail those are those are the little the little things that I like to film all those little tiny cutaway shots that you see in a film are like the glue that hold all the big shots together Todd Heater, I've worked with him for 15 years now, and we just have a good synergy. Like, I don't have to tell him what shots to get. He's already thinking it, and he, he's doing it better than I imagined. I think the reason that people like and watch these films is that it makes them feel good. It gives them the, the sense of not only surfing, but what a, what a place in the world feels like, which is something that it's really hard to convey in a film. Going down this dirt road and seeing where it leads. I'm hoping that it leads to a wave, but. Four hours past the road, met a really nice construction worker. Someone gave us some rough directions and we've been doing laps around, but that's how it works down here. You get down here and you ask just a local surfer, do you know another wave? And then someone will bite it down on napkins and then you go down, and see where it ends up. So we're gonna go to the end of that. Good vibes. <laughs> I like good vibes. With stiff. So I was instantly really, really excited to do uh, another trip with Taylor and the crew that gathers around him. And then when he mentioned that, that I would be going on a trip with Steph, I was just like, oh, okay, yep, I'm keen. I'm super duper keen, let's do it. I admire Dave surfing, I always have. In my eyes, he is the Tom Curran of Australia. To get to surf with, you know, the most amazing female surfer on the planet at the height of her powers, that's pretty special. You speak to almost any surfer on the planet that, that has actually done trips with him or surfed with him, they'll all say that Dave is one of the best surfers that you ever witness in the ocean because he's literally like a merman. <laughs> but. <laughs>